Now I will be talking to you about some keyboard commands. These are really handy and can help you from scrolling the screen everywhere to get some of your stuff done when you can just do it with your keyboard. If you want your followers to do something and only that, if you hold on to shift and do the command, then they'll aim for that command only and not do anything else. This is usually helpful with fire warriors attacking an enemy shaman because then they'll ignore all the other enemy warriors and fire warriors and aim directly for the shaman and try to kill her. It can be done in towers as well when the shaman's on the advance. If you have followers selected and want them to enter a specific type of building, if you just click the buildings panel, hold on to shift and then left click in the buildings panel of what building you want them to enter and they'll head straight to the nearest type of building that you clicked on. This can be done with instantly training troops but it doesn't always work when you want fire warriors and towers because some, for some reason the game won't allow, allow it early on in the game so sometimes you'll have to do it manually. If you have some people selected and you press D on your keyboard then they'll dodge all over the place. This is useful for dodging enemy spells and can also be used to confuse the enemy. Grouping your people isn't really necessary but can be a useful thing to have when you're about to attack. Select your followers, hold on to shift and press number 1, set in the group. Then when you press the number 1, you'll instantly select the followers. This can be done with numbers from 1 to 6, having 6 type of groups. If you have some followers selected and you press G on your keyboard, then they'll go and guard around the shaman. This is useful if you want to keep your braves temporarily active and it's done by most people on creators at the start to get quicker land bridges and converts but it can be used for other things as well. There's a special trick that you can do with the button N as well. If you make some followers patrol but still holding on to control and let go of alt if you click somewhere else they'll still patrol at the same point and when you press N they'll run towards the point where you clicked. This can be done with multiple fo followers and multiple patrol points and you can make them all go to a specific point when you press N. I don't use it much but if you want to get into the habit of using it then that's fine. It's your playing style so it's your decision. A couple of other handy buttons. If you press H you'll zoom directly to your reincarnation site and if you press the dot button then you'll zoom directly to your shaman. But I don't usually use dot because if you go to the shaman box in the top left hand corner and just right click on her you'll zoom to her. And that's just some of the keyboard commands. I won't go through all of them because there's quite a lot. Just experiment with your keyboard to find colors and you'll see how these shortcuts can become great use.